Welcome back to another video guys. Here I'm gonna share with you how to create these adorable individual charcuterie cups. And these are perfect you guys for this New Year's Eve party if you're having one. Um, pretty much any holiday party but at this point you guys we are celebrating New Year's Eve and I thought these would be perfect to have at your party including not just charcuterie but some awesome awesome sweet chocolate bark and i'm going to share with you how to create all of this for your party super easy and simple all right guys first things first let's have our ingredients ready and here i have my crackers the salamis olives cheese dry fruit and nuts and i wanted to keep it simple just pretty much the basics that you will put in a charcuterie board but in this case they're going to be in charcuterie glass cups you guys i thought these were so cute and adorable for the occasion and i also wanted to add this yummy yummy sweet tree called chocolate bark which is super easy to make if you have not seen that video you guys where i make these you must go and click on that video right now and watch it because it's super easy and simple and it tastes delicious you guys so moving on Hello and welcome if you're new to my channel. My name is Sherry Laverde. I'm just sharing with you here how we're gonna start putting all of our ingredients into these cups, okay? So I'm gonna start here just with my dry fruit, which in this case is cranberries. Then I'm gonna add my um, nuts, and I believe I had um, peanuts here. And moving on, I wanna use two picks, you guys, to go ahead and just create these uh, little olives I just didn't want to throw them in the cup like that I think this will be easier for you to grab when you're eating or when you have your cup in hand and then I go ahead and do the same thing you guys with the cheese so these are already pre-cut square cheese they're Colby so it works great because it's your mixture of your white and um, yellow cheese now I'm just folding my salami into fours you guys and just adding them to the cup and I'm going to share with you a little bit later um, another way that you can create this with the salami as well. So I did it two different ways to see which one was going to look the best, okay? <laughs> now I'm just going to go ahead and add my crackers and I had two different kinds. Um, not only in taste but also in shape and I just thought that gave the cup a little dimension as well So it looks like here just standing by themselves will look good. So You guys this is super simple and easy to make if you are in charge of bringing something to a party This is something that you want to make They're again super easy simple to put together And what can I say you guys just makes the perfect New Year's Eve appetizer. All right? So moving along, look at this, how it looks. That was super fast and easy, right? I think what it take, like a minute? Like, look how easy and fast that was. But we're not done. Now we're going to add our chocolate bark, you guys. And I've already made this previously. So pretty much this is a part two video to this part one, which is how to make a chocolate bark. Go check out that video if you don't have seen it before. I'm going to put the link above so you can see how simple and easy it is to make it so that you can add it to your charcuterie. So before I end it you guys, I want to make a second cup. It's pretty much adding the same things. So we're doing the same, adding our dry fruits and nuts, our crackers, cheese. That's pretty much what I'm going to do. But what I decided on this one was that when adding my salami, I was going to go ahead and use a toothpick and fold it, right? Again, you can see right here, I fold it in fours and then I add a toothpick. And I just thought that seemed simpler and easier to add to my cup at the end. So therefore, the rest of the cups, that's what I did. Okay, and I wanted to share that with you guys. So here you are. Let me show you. They're looking nice, right? It just gives it this little shape, something different. And it's easier for it to stand on the cup versus it falling into the cup. Okay, and that's what was happening to the first one that I did. So moving along, you guys, this video is going to end soon. I wanted to share this because I am all excited about sharing with you guys how to create different um, charcuteries and I just think they're a special way to just be creative in your own way, make it for your family, have some kind of appetizer in different holidays, occasions, in this case we're talking about New Year's Eve party and they're perfect you guys and they're simple too so if you're the non-cook of the family this is probably what you want to be doing and trust me you will impress your guests and your family once you start creating these and that's my hope and wish you guys to inspire you to create this adorable adorable charcuterie everything okay 
so we are ending here but let me show you don't leave yet guys let me show you what this is gonna look at the end so I have this cup look what it looks like now we're just filling up the spaces so pretty much that's what I'm doing here I have this glass where you can see what's inside so filling up the spaces is important and look at this super adorable cute look at that right am I right comment below if you agree yeah okay so look what they're looking like now I just did four as a sample to show you but wait a minute look what it's gonna look when you set it up on your table you guys are you ready there you go look at this you guys individual charcuterie cups with everything yummy inside but look at these chocolate barks you guys this is the perfect sweet to add into your cups they were super delicious super easy and simple to make like i said this is a part two to my first video where I show you how to make char uh, chocolate bark so go ahead and click that watch it it's super easy and simple and look at you guys you can add it to your table on New Year's Eve with a nice bottle of whatever you're drinking that day and what can I say you guys doesn't that make the perfect New Year's Eve appetizers like this video you guys if you agree comment below your thoughts or if you're making these let me know what you're thinking and what can I say you guys have an amazing and amazing rest of your year happy new year and i'm wishing you the best for 2022 and i cannot wait you guys to share with you a lot more videos on this channel have a good one i'll see you next time bye guys